share this channel on the internet. How are you doing guys and welcome back to part 2 to the biggest sandbar party I ever attended. Hopefully mines get this big too. And we got special guests, Gabby brought her friends for the event. And we headed out for a 45 mile cruise. But like you saw in part 1, it was through the bay and that made it easy and comfortable. And also we had... Alex and his crew come along with us for the ride. And we have done this cruise many times so for us it doesn't seem that long but it actually took us an hour and 30 minutes. And it was amazing to see how many boats were here attending the party. There must have been hundreds. It looked even bigger than last year. There were boats everywhere. On the sandbar, by the sandbar, by the islands, by the railroad tracks. They were just everywhere. And a great thing about this event is most people bring the whole family, kids and all, like me because everybody could enjoy the sandbar life. And if this is your first video you see from our channel, make sure to like it and subscribe for more fun in the sun. Look at this guys. Gabby's having fun. And the cool thing about this event, they actually have a floating stage that they play music from and some bands come and sing live. So we're gonna go by and check it out. Okay, so if you guys want to see the complete detailed video of part one, I'm going to leave a link on the video description below. And for those people that actually watched part one and said funny comments about the video, well, you guys missed the whole point of the video. The thing is this, Sandbar Life is all about having fun in the sun. It doesn't matter the music, the type of people, or the environment, as long as everybody has a good time on the water, on the sand, having fun in the sun. I mean, I have to admit, the party is a little different than Miami, but still lots of fun and a lot of people enjoying themselves. Plus, there's no shame in the game. Alright guys, and you know I've been telling you that the West Coast start boating early and they finish early? Well, this sandbar party started at 10 o'clock in the morning and right now it's about 
3.30 in the afternoon and it's still going. And according to the few fans that I spoke to, they said that earlier there were more people on the sandbar because they came to see the live bands. And once they stop, most of them go home. So next year, I'm gonna try to make it early and see how many people really come here. Because even as late as it is, I'm still impressed how many people showed up or stayed this late. But one thing I do love is watching everybody have fun in the sun. And that's what Sandbar Life is all about. And talking about that, you guys better get ready because July 29th, Sandbar Party, all over. Keep your eyes open on Instagram and YouTube community posts for more information. But after about two hours of jumping around and enjoying the music, we decided to go back. Go back and load up on our energy levels. And like usual, when it comes to music, Ovida never stops dancing. Yeah. And that was lots of fun. But now here comes the best part of the day. So Alex has cooking sausage time to the next level. You brought a griddle. Yo. That's how we do it. That's how we do it. He got a full kitchen. He got the griddle here and he got the barbecue over there. It wasn't there. Oh look what's in there. Yo. He's ready for everything. Oh no. Fried cheese. Got a whole kitchen right here. And I got a point on the front cooler. Okay, so if you guys been seeing my videos for a while now, you notice that I hang around with different type of people that cook different things on their barbecue on the sandbar. But I think Alex got me today because he's making fried queso and sausages. This is starting to feel like aquatic flavors in Miami with a full out kitchen. And for those people that are wondering what does fried queso tastes like well buy it do it yourself at home and then let me know if you like it or not because i love it i guess we'll call it latin grilled cheese but without the bread and while the rest are playing in the water me i'm staying near the food because i'm hungry and i bought chicken but i'm gonna have to taste the fried queso and the fried sausages and also if you guys want to try this too Get your fried chicken and heat it up on the barbecue. It tastes even better. Here, help them out there, dude. It's hot. But they just came out. Maybe mm. ready with a fried cheese? You put like a little bit of oil. It's cooked. Yeah, 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 I know, I know. Some people call it a boating show, some people call it a food show. I call it enjoy your life every minute you can, and if it's on the water, it's even better. Well, this is pretty cool because after all the dancing around and walking around, now we get to relax in the water and eat some sausages. It doesn't get better than this. But I knew my relaxing wouldn't last that long because now she wants to take some pictures. Plus the day is actually beautiful. Alright. Ok, 
Okay, now she wants to take photography to the next level. Oh, you want to get on there? I'm gonna record it just in case she falls down. Cause she wants to be all sexy. Look, look. She don't want to touch the floor. She want to take pictures, but she don't want to touch the floor. <laughs> look, 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 look. Yeah. She's afraid of the stuff okay, in the water. Yeah. <laughs> so how was your day here at that West Coast sandbar party, baby? Oh my god, they have the perfect. Yeah, the water. Look at guys. I'm gonna give it a. I'm gonna give it a nine. Pretty close, it's really clear today. Look at that. Well, a lot of people have gone home, but we're still here. Because we're from Miami, we're the late comers. We're the late comers and late leavers. <laughs> that is true right there. Yeah, okay. Got it. Nice. Jump! Oh yeah, that I like. Right here. Yeah, that's what I need for all over. We start talking about fishing, and I told him about you guys that you go 60 miles, and he goes, I know a spot 30 miles out, and I clean house. Same shit that they're getting. Right, but, so it's out, but it's out of. Shit, what did he say? Uh, out of. Uh, I saw your car. I told you what it was. No, I think it's out of. Uh... No, yeah. Oh my god. Are you guys having fun? Yeah. What are you guys playing? Chase. You got a big old scratch. Yeah. Alright, so what, what, what do you guys think? What do you guys think about the sandbar West Side Party? It's awesome, man. You like it? Better than the regatta. Yeah, yeah. Minus, so the, yeah. minus the really? oh, minus flashy. Nice. The flashy. No, I don't have to Hey, if we would have stopped the party city, maybe we would have had some. Yeah, extra beads. Yeah. beads. yeah. So, what do you guys think about the, the party? Hey, yeah. What do you guys think about the party? Really cool. Awesome. Coming back next year? Definitely. Girl, many words. <laughs> many words. Are you guys ready for that two hour ride home? Yeah. So yeah, I guess you go to sleep. We'll wake up when we get home. You wanna go to sleep too? Maybe. So how was your day at the at the party? Well guys, you saw it. It was an awesome day here at Boca Grande Sandbar Life Party. And definitely, I'll be coming back next year 
and I try to make it early to catch more people dancing around because that was pretty entertaining. Especially if you're like me that like to do people watching, well definitely you're gonna watch a lot of people here. Thank you.